Hey everyone, this is Josh Galvin with Tizich.com. On this video tutorial, I'm going to show you what the title attribute is to links. Okay, so here's basically what that is, just to make it completely clear. Here I have another article, that, um, another blog posting I've done from Tizich. And I basically, you see these links here? You see when I hover over them, how they say different words? You see how this one says Josh Galvin's profile when I hover over it? And this one says Tizich's Facebook page. And this one here says Facebook. Now basically that little box you see that comes up, that's what's called your your link title attribute. Alright? Now you have full control over that. Now before I show you how to use it, here's why it matters and here's why you should care. On every single link you do, for better usability, meaning the users of your website that come to it, before they click on a link, if you hover if they hover over it and see information that's related to them wanting to click on it, it's gonna help you get more people actually engaging with your website. Not only is that better for engaging with your website in general, but when you link to articles that are that are um, that are your own, when you interlink. So, for example, here you see this. Um, here is the actual how-to on this. There's a link that I have that I say. There's an article I say is related to this one. So when I highlight over this link, you see how the text says "Be efficient with your social media marketing." That is a phrase that is going to make someone want to be curious about okay what is this link about so when they click on this link they're now on another page that's my website you get it so now they're on a page that's my website so the whole point is I'm keeping them on my website and I'm doing this by giving them linking examples that give good little captions as you the good little title attributes so this is just one of the extra things that help with getting more people to keep using your site and then another quick tip uh, reason why this is important is that you start defining what your site's about not only to the eyes of Google and uh, not only to your users but most very importantly to the eyes of Google so when you link to your own content and you start using these different keywords and so forth you're not getting direct ranking or relevance for the keywords but you kind of are just to keep it very simple so understand it does have an SEO benefit um, not only when you link to yourself but when you outer link to other related sites it has a good SEO benefit all right so it's important to use these. So here's how you use them. And again, this is explaining to people that are using WordPress. All right. So here I am in the WordPress panel. This is the article found here. Okay. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna change this anchor text of personal profile to instead say instead of saying Josh Galvin's profile, I'll make it say something like I don't know my personal. I'll make it up. Doesn't matter. So here's the whole point. Um, what you could do is you click on the link and then you click on the edit link button, of course. And on WordPress, on WordPress, when you insert a link, there's a thing called title that you can put in whatever keyword you want. So let's say I say, this is just a demo, demo link. And that's my title of this, of this editing the link. When I click on update, and when I preview this, what's gonna happen now is that exact same link, you see how the text, you see how the text now says this is just a demo link so the whole point is you in your in your WordPress panel you have the ability to change your title attributes alright and I highly recommend you make them be related to what the actual link is about so here let's just say let's do another example let's say tagging friends right let's pretend this was just a link let's say this was a link to another tutorial I had right I'm just gonna I'm making it up I'm not there's no there's no link that I'm actually Okay, so so here we go. Now let's say the title I wanted this link to be um, So now I, I just made that up. I made up a whole an example link title. So now when I go here when it refreshes, here's our new links tagging friends and see when I hover over it, it has the text awesome Facebook tutorial. So basically you just control what your links say. This is great for usability and great it'll help with your SEO as well. All right, so make sure you do these items. If you have any questions, then go to facebook.com forward slash tizish and ask away there. If you took any value from this or enjoyed it, then like it, comment on it, or share it. Either way works. All right, well have a good day. Take care.